Hi oh yeah guys, Peter Webb still here again, back again for another unboxing video. Um, I've got two or three more unboxing videos due this week up till the weekend. But we'll start off with this one. This one came this morning from the spider shop. And there's one spider in here that I ordered that unfortunately was out of stock by the time I put my order in. But the guys, Lee and Sam, as always sorted it all out and we'll begin what I ordered as soon as they come in so there we go let's have a look what we got in here I've got to watch because I'll end up cutting my finger I thought it's going right as you would expect from the spider shop packing peanuts they can go into the body back down here. Right, let's get this one box out. As always, it's a box in the box. Okay, just do that box up a minute. Okay, next box, see if we can do it without cutting my finger off. My wife's there as always, keeping an eye on me, she knows what I'm like. And yeah. As we expect from the spider shop packing, more ruddy peanuts. The body bag's filling up, but not with peanuts, with everything else. Looks like a chip down the tip for me, guys. Right. I'll start off by telling you that I ordered a Seminax which unfortunately by the time I got the order in they were out of stock and Sam found me the other day to tell me that they'd now got the permit to sell adult females and when that one comes into stock I think he mentioned there's around 50 or something coming in he's going to send me one out and I've got to pay the shipping which is really good of them because the price is between I believe he said between 20 and 30 pounds. So, I'll uh, dig a few more peanuts out and then we'll get to the seals in here. Right. First one. This is a Salma Pius Redonkus, which is the orange mouth, Costa Rican orange mouth. So, we'll see if she's okay before I go off to the camera. I actually gifted one of these to um, Mr. Greg Rose because I know I've got another one on the way. To be honest, guys, I don't know if it's worth showing you, but uh, you can see the fairiness down the bottom of the hole either way. The wife just come in and focus a little bit. You can see just down there. A little bundle of fairness joy. So we'll be raising that little girl soon. Next one we have, um, I believe this is the Afana Palma Hensi, if my memory serves me correct. Oh, look what this little guy's up to. Oh, hello. With two little legs, I don't beauty. Okay guys, got to be a quick one this time because she's on the way out. Okay. And I will be doing a reaction of these tomorrow. But today I just want to get them out of the box and make sure they're all happy and alive. That's number two. Number three. 
we have the blue female, what was that called? The H blue female, I can't think off the top of my head guys, I'm really sorry. My head just shed just like I just don't know what I'm doing. So I'm so sorry. But if you if you research H blue femur you'll see her down the bottom there. She's alive and well in the moist tissue. So she'll be another one reosing. And next time I come on camera I will know the name of it. I'm not sure if it's Aplopelma blue femur or what, but I'm not 100% sure, so I won't commit to that. And I believe the last one, let's just make sure there's no more in the box. If there was, it'd have a bloody LA by now. Now that's it. Let's just dispose of these chips. Right, fold, fold this box up to go in the box pile in front of the window. And this one, um, ah, oh, I know this one. This is the Pamphibetus ultramarinus. It's the most disease run out the lot. As you know, I'm trying to accumulate the Pamphibetus genus complete collection and I'm well on my way. I'll show you a quick glimpse of her there. She's sat in the top of the tub. She has moved, so I know she's all well and good till tomorrow. And that's it. There's my four little guys. My Pamphibetus ultramanus. My H blue femur my Haplopalma Vinci and which one was this one? my Salmopia Sudunkus so guys if you've enjoyed that brief video please like comment and subscribe share the video as much as you want I'm not shy give it to whoever you want to see who you think will be interested in my uh, my junky videos as you know I don't um, edit anything what you see is what you get so from me peter webster guys i love you all and i'll see you on the next one no doubt it'll be another unboxing video because we've got three or four on the way i'm not 100 percent sure i lose track of what i order and when i order to be perfectly fair with you guys so especially the lids on this little guy because the other day um, we had a knock on the door and one of the neighbours kids come up and said I think Pete's spiders got loose in the street and lo and behold the wife went out with the daughter with a big mixing bowl and a piece of cardboard and it was the Kilabrachis species Vietnam blue that got out. How I don't know. My only reasoning for her getting out is that with the heat it expanded overnight possibly the corner lifted up and during the night as it cooled down it was it had pulled back down but either way we've got the little guy back in there happy as Larry all it was doing was striking at me and giving me evil poses as, as killer brackets are known for so for now anyway guys enough said enough waffling on uh, take care guys and I'll always be here if you need a chat just give me a shout on Facebook I'm always willing for a good yarn with everyone. And we'll see you in the next video, guys. So from me, Peter Webster, as usual, goodbye, guys. Love you all. Take care.